I think that was maybe your first time <laughs> participating in a full practice, just how do you feel after all of that? Yeah, I feel great. It's obviously nice to be out with the team, guy, the, the guys again, and um, just to see the faces and be out with the new guys, it's, it's always fun. So, um, exciting day for sure, and um, just the first step. Are you at all ahead or in line with the forecast that Kyle gave us maybe the first five games of the season? And just yeah, it's, it's too early to tell. Just kind of got to wait and see. Um, Obviously, you just got to wait and see what happens and stay by everything. Have you been cleared for any kind of uh, contact? You, you, you weren't wearing, like, the alternate jersey that you were Yeah, before. just kind of the first day, first step today. So it was just kind of nice to be out with the guys and, um, and kind of see what happened from there. So once again, it's just it's an exciting day for me, and um, hopefully it comes more with it. Jay, not to bring up bad memories, but you went through one where you, you know, had one in season and tried to come back. And this one is you're trying to come back at the start of the season. What, What's the difference emotionally? What has this been like emotionally? Yeah, I mean, it's obviously disappointing you never want to go through something like this, but you realize it's part of the game and it's going to happen, injuries happen. So, um, yeah, yeah, just just decided to do it in the summer and obviously, hopefully, kind of see what happens here next couple of days. Is it easier from a straight standpoint, though, to do it in the summer? Yeah, oh, for sure. It's just you never want to miss um, being around the guys or um, the situations that the team is in. So. It's a little bit easier to do it some for sure. You were, you've, seen the, you've seen the positive impact that off-season procedures have had with Sid and Gino. Both. Does that kind of make it, I mean, it really help them out? They're more durable players. Do you feel like this can have a similar effect on you? Yeah, hopefully. I mean, um, you don't want to miss too many games as much as possible. So right. just to have it in the summer and um, to have a lot of the, the staff around, I think, is a big thing because, you know, during the season they're traveling a lot. So um, it's, it's been a huge for me. And, uh, it's been nice so far. You've kind of come to the other side, but at the time, you started trying to play in the, de the the beauty league, and then obviously some things just weren't going well for you. That must have been a pretty tough time right then to have to decide to step back and have the surgery, I'd imagine. Yeah, for sure. I mean, it obviously just didn't heal properly the way we thought it was going to, so um, we just kind of decided last minute to uh, to go this route, and, and now we're here, so it's just kind of hope for the best. When did it first happen? What's that? When did it first happen? Uh, last year. During the season? Yeah. Jake, I know sometimes injured guys feel isolated. So how nice is it to have a few days of team bonding with the guys this past weekend? Yeah, it's huge. I mean, obviously for me, I haven't been around the guys much on and off the ice. So just to go on the road trip and, and be part of the team, it's, it's obviously a good day and a good weekend for all of us. It, it was a lot of fun to see kind of Sid's town and uh, to see what he's all about there. What have you thought about the new guys in the room? Yeah, it's, it's been awesome. I mean, um, a lot of personalities, and, and we're just gelling pretty well so far. So it's been a great time. Power play just useless without you so far. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Jake. <laughs> Thanks, Thanks. Thanks.